Hello to you, Travelers, and welcome back to the Best Corona Channel here on YouTube, here today on Football Manager 24. Early access has just been released, ladies and gentlemen, and we are kicking off our brand new early access save here with Arsenal. Of course, I do support Arsenal, and if you've seen the thumbnail, Harkel Tuveta is coming to make Kai Havertz a Ballon d'Or winner. That is one of the goals in this series, ladies and gentlemen. The overall goal is, of course, to win the Champions League. If you guys have any other goals that you want to reach throughout this little series, let me know in the comments down below. But my own personal one is to make Kai Havertz a Ballon d'Or winner. The team objective is to win the Champions League. And again, if you guys have any extra uh, little goals and objectives, let me know in the comments down below. Please do leave a thumbs up on this video and subscribe if you haven't already, ladies and gentlemen. Trying to build more of an FM fan base. Football Manager was the first ever gameplay video on this channel. It holds a special place in my heart. And we're going to dive straight in. Now, I do want to say in the background, I am currently bringing my graphics over from FM23. So in this episode, there won't be no logos or face packs, anything like that. But starting from episode two, we're going to have all the logos, the kits, the face packs and everything like that all updated in the save. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, we're going to go to... If it actually... There we go. New game. Uh, go to career. And there's now a new... Oh, I already have. Oh, my God. Oh, it's already brought over some of them then. We already have some of the logos, as you can see. It's slowly bringing some over, um, which is awesome, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Now, I do uh, quickly want to point out, this is just an early access save. So, we're only going to be playing this for the first two, three weeks before the full game is released November 6th. And then we are starting our Manager Reputation Challenge, which is a long-term series, ladies and gentlemen. So, again... If you're an FM fan, subscribe and stick around for that. We're going to start unemployed with half a star reputation. And we have to go all the way to five star reputation. I'll explain more about that in that series. But for now, let's focus on Arsenal. We're going to choose Arsenal to manage. And then a new thing in FM24, game mode, ladies and gentlemen. Original is the original way to play Football Manager. Updated squads will be used at the start of the season. So all of the transfers that have happened will be there straight away from day one. Then you have Real World, which is I think the one we're going to be using. Players will start at the club they were with at the start of their career. They will then move to the new club on the same day they did in real life. So whenever someone joins the team in real life, if they join them in August, they'll join in August in the game. If they joined in July, they'll join in July. If they have a future transfer already planned, that will already be, uh, be implemented, ladies and gentlemen. Now, I want to keep it as realistic as possible for this Arsenal save. I want to use Kai Havertz and all the new players like Timber and stuff like that. So we're going to run with new uh, real world. But you can also do your world where the budgets are completely what they would have been before all of the transfers. So a lot of people are going to redo Chelsea and Man U, I feel, to redo their transfer. Now, but we're going to go real world. I'm going to go advanced setup here. There is our lovely Mr. Manager. Oh, he has a little hearing aid. I didn't recognize that, but we're going to keep it. Why not? Uh, use profile. That is A-OK. -okay. Uh, global level and Continental Pro, of course. We're going to go for the Max. Here we go, then. A brand new series. A brand new journey. Arsenal. Higher 2v. These Arsenal saves, again, they hold so much... Uh, a special place in my heart because the first ever series was an Arsenal FM. I think it was 17 or 18 series. Arsenal today confirmed the appointment of Harry Tuvey as the club's new manager. The 25 year inexperienced 25. Okay, okay, don't go too in depth. Uh, we already have the kits and everything, which I think they're the, our last year's kits, but that's a okay. We'll update them as we go. We're going to get all the trophies and everything. Again, that's all coming over uh, slowly and steadily. Uh, first rivals Tottenham, Edu Gasp. Oh, I can't believe. We are a brand we're gonna get the face back as well. Don't you worry. I can't believe a brand new football manager game is upon us. Here we go. Let's get stuck in. Reminder that this video is sponsored by Regents Pro Wrestling, the number one wrestling show in sports entertainment, the most action-packed, immersive, and entertaining show on all of YouTube. Watch live every Monday and Friday, right here on the Regents Kid YouTube channel. And remember, this is who we are. Now, I have disabled the first uh, transfer window. I want it to be fresh. I want it to be, this is our team. Uh, the team that they made is our team, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, you can import your views. Oh, my goodness. Right, so they want us to challenge for the Premier League title. It is required. Play attacking football, entertaining football, finish above Tottenham, Man U, Chelsea, and Liverpool in the league. Uh, reached the last stages. Of course, we are in the Champions League. They want to qualify for the Champions League this year. So a top four finish. Challenge for FA Cup. Ah, interesting. Okay, we can accept that. That is A-OK. -okay. Uh, players in the last year, enough time remaining his contract, has a one-year extension cl uh, clause. Does Jorginho. Mohamed Nene, Cedric in his... Right, Cedric up first. Okay, all new stuff here. 
Oh, you can't just offer to clubs anymore, can you? Offer via transfer room. Oh, so that basically is the new offer to clubs. Okay. Cedric, you can go. Schedule. What is the schedule looking like? Man City away first and then Chelsea at home. Are you kidding me? Manchester City and Chelsea. We have Liverpool at home, Man U at home. Tottenham, we play everyone at home first. Liverpool away is our last game of the season. Oh, they are doing us in here dirty, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely dirty. I think for tactics-wise, we're going to go for a 4-2-3-1, a 4-3-3, and then a maybe three up top formation. Uh, again, you guys in the comments can be the scouts and coaches. If you guys want to scout anyone, let me know players to buy in the comments. Let me know tactics to use, where you want to use people. Do you think Kai Havertz should be a centre mid, a striker, a winger? Let me know. It's your team as well as my team, and we're going to do this together. Odegaard, of course, one of our better players, centre mid and attacking mid. Uh, Bukayo Saka, one of the star boys. Martinelli, the other star boy on the left-hand side. Where is the main man? Kai Havertz. He is going to be a Ballon d'Or winner, ladies and gentlemen, by the time we are done. So look, so Renarsson, he's already joining Cardiff. Tyrese John Jewell. So a lot of people are already leaving. Nicolas Pepe is joining Trabunzor. Nuno Tavares. A lot of these guys are already leaving. Uh, I'm just going to move them to the under-21s because they're going to go anyway. That's interesting. Emil Smith Road, loan listed. See, I'm going to take him off the loan list. Uh, we're going to take him off. Kieran Tierney is, of course, going away as well. He's already gone. That's I like that real well. They transfer. So, so do we have anyone coming in, or have we already signed everyone? David Rea joins on the 15th. So we don't have David Rea yet. He's going to join us on the 15th, because that's when he joined in real life. All these people are on their way out. Uh, we have zero transfer budget. I've, I've turned the window off anyway. So pretty much all there is to do is get to the first game of the season. Realistic. Oh, no. Firstly, let's attend the meeting. Declan Rice captain. Instead of Odegaard. No, 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 no. We'll, we'll, we'll keep... We'll keep Odegaard. Actually, actually, I don't care about this meeting. I want to go to the set pieces. Because set... Oh, firstly... Uh, staff. Staff is very important. We're going to sign some scouts. Sign some coaches. And beef up our back room. Club atmosphere. They are loving life from the pre-season form. Uh, they've been winning every single game. And they've been loving life. Oh, they skipped the community shield. We won the community shield. Oh, I forgot we was in the community. Oh, man. I started at the start of the season. I didn't think it would skip the community shield, but... Arsenal win the community shield. We don't even get the trophy for that on our record, do we? Cups. Oh, man, we missed out on the community shield. Damn. Right, so set piece introduction. This is new, ladies and gentlemen. All the new set piece stuff is brand new, so... Your Imperial Squad, what defensive marking strategy do you prefer? This will impact our teams defend corners and free kicks. Zonal marking, defenders will cover key areas of the pitch. Uh, protects key areas of the box. Opponents can get a running start. Crosses in between zones can cause confusion. Player marking or hybrid? We're going to go for player marking. Everyone picks a player. What post do you want players marking while defending? Both post. How many players would you like to leave forward for the counter-attack? I, I love a good counter-attack. I love a good counter-attack. Uh, we're going to be marking, how do you prefer the ball to be delivered? Oh, from attacking set pieces. Oh, I normally like a near post. Uh, I like a near post. How many players do you want to leave back when defending? More players will be left back to nullify. Fewer defenders will stay back. Oh, we'll go balanced. In swing. I like an in swinger. I love an in I hate out swingers. I'm po Let me know in the comments down below. In swing or out swinger? Oh, this is new. Oh my goodness. This is stressful. <laughs> okay, so it's, I, I think it's all the same though. Realistically. So attack and defend. In swinger. Gabriel Martinelli. Near post. Aerial threats. Attack near post. Ah, so it's no longer people. So he's the taker. Gabriel Martinelli. He's attacking the near post. Oh, so it puts our best, I think it puts our best person on the box. So Saliba has 16 heading, he's got 15, he's got 14. So it puts all of our best aerial threats in the box. Already got an achievement, you have a happy squad. Very nice. Um, I'd like to talk about probably aims about the upcoming season. I want to say I want to win the league, but I don't know if they're confident enough. I think we have a chance to do quite well in the league. I want to win the league. Oh, and catch offended. Are you sure? No, I insist. I don't want losers in this dressing room. I don't want losers. Champions League. Um, latter stages. They're happy with it. 
FA Cup win. They're happy with it. Lovely. Overall, they're happy. Received a positive reaction from a team meeting. Well done, Harkel Tuveta. He's done well. Um, Timber is injured for nine to ten months, I've just realized. The injury did indeed carry over. He got injured nine to ten months. Oh boy, that is um that is not ideal. I'll be I'll be honest with you. Juvie to meet the media. Hello, hello, hello. Uh there's over, uh, overwhelming emotion is excitement. I can't wait to get started. We have an intra squad friendly. We're not going to be managing the friendlies. I want to get straight into Man City away from home. I don't really want to. I'd rather run and cry. We went 2-1. Only 2-1. The starting 11. Jesus up top. Martinelli Smith Rowe and Saka gets the goal. Smith Rowe, Cam, Odegaard center mid is interesting. Second 11. Mark was there. Charlie Patino. Damn. I mean, we dominated them to be fair, but only two, go uh, two goals. Man City and Chelsea, by the way. Outrageous. Matt Turner is gone. No offers for Cedric. William Saliba injured. No, no, no. Right, Jim Lawler. Our staff is coming in. Erling Haaland. Gabriel Jesus for top goal scorer odds. 14 finishing. Oh, no. Hey, all of the stuff is got, uh, copied over now. The face packs are all here. Uh, the trophies are here as well. You can see the FA Cup. Uh, Champions League. All the real life trophies are here as well. Uh, beautiful. We even have the background now. Perk, does that change per team? I don't like that background back there, but it's there. Uh, Man City is approaching. Oh, I love having the face packs and everything. All the real life transfers will be going on as well. I'm nervous about the new routines. I've changed our training schedule slightly. Uh, also, just in case you're wondering, we do have last year's kits, like I say. Um, I mean, this pink is our best kit ever anyway, but I will get an updated. Ver there is already an updated version. I just want to start recording, so I will get that for next episode. David Rea joins us on the 15th, so we're going to be without David Rea for the first game. They don't really use David Rea in real life, uh, so they don't use Ramsdale anymore. They've swapped to David Rea, so going to be interesting to see who we prefer as our starting goalkeeper. Again, you guys can let me know. Uh, top player odds, Saka and Odegaard are both potentially up for that award. What is the Premier League uh, season preview? Arsenal predicted third after a good year last year. Um... Managerial debut. I can't believe we got Man City. I'm going to include both of them in the first episode. Why not? Man City and Chelsea in the first episode. I cannot believe that we have these two teams to start off. Charlie Patino goes. Young player odds. Bukayo Saka is there. And the Premier League is underway. Bournemouth get the first win. 95th minute winner. Do they have the new additional minutes on this game? I don't know if they do real life added on minutes. They haven't really announced that yet. But I'm nervous and excited. Let me know in the comments down below right now what you think the score will be away from Man City. I'll be honest, I'm not too confident. It's my first ever game, uh, you know, match on the new game. I'm not overly confident, but we'll see how we do. They're playing a 4-3-3 now. I think at home, I was thinking a 4-2-3-1. But away from home, I think we match them with a 4-3-3 as well. Party and Odegaard are linking up nicely. The only problem with a 4-3-3 is... We don't really get to fit um, Kai Havertz in. Oh, I love the extended view. I'm going to go for the smaller one, though, as well. It's not a very big team. We don't have a, a lot of options in our reserves. I will be honest with you. Saliba does have a knock, but realistically, we need Saliba at the back. We have Edin Ketcher on the bench. He has the same finishing as um, Kai Havertz has 11 finishing. Oh, no. He was so good on FM23. Can we train his shooting? Um, I'll take control. Because I low-key wanted him to potentially be a striker for us. Gabriel Jesus. Pressing or deep lying? Uh, pressing uses speed. Off the ball. We're going to go deep lying. Hopefully he can create for Saka and Martinelli. On either wing. We have a high press. Counter-attack in football. Oh, Trossard on the... <sighs> Havertz on the bench. I really want to start him, if I'm honest, but I don't know where he really fits in. Thomas Partey as a half-back. We're going to go Declan Rice as a... Oh, Cariello is always nice. Martin Odegaard as a deep-line playmaker because I don't want to push up too much is the only problem. Winger-back support. Uh, going to go inverted wing... Oh, inverted fullback's a new one. Inverted wing-back. On support for Zinchenko. Ben White right back. Can he deal with it? Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, they actually have to learn your routines now as well for the set pieces. Again, I'll, I'll look more into the set pieces because I'm not too... You know, they're, they're, they're all new 
obviously. Oh, you can have more than one routine. And how often you want to use it, that's pretty cool. We're going to go balanced. I think that's what we're going to go for. I'm, I'm very nervous. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm very, very nervous. First game on FM24. Premier League underway. Manchester City, of course. Erling Haaland up top. We're in the black kit. We have the 3D kits as well. I know the last years, but hey, oh. We'll have a bit of uh, atmosphere in the background. Etihad Stadium. New gameplay engine and everything. We have all the face packs, logos and everything. Again, the kits will be updated next episode. Premier League is underway. There are the teams coming out to the pitch. I don't care about you. And here we go. Let me quickly do this. So I like to play on TV, in case you're wondering what I play on. And here we go. Premier League underway. Manchester City v Arsenal. First match of FM24. Eventually we'll get skins and stuff like that to go along with it. Manchester City. Oh, oh if they score in the first minute. Grealish. Ball in already. Ben White, let's not faff about. Oh, I'm already nervous. Oh, there's way more tabs for like the height and zoom now, which I like. Can I pull this out a little bit? There we go. Goals are going in across the Premier League. I mean, if we can beat Manchester City, it, it would be a result, eh? It would be a result. Right, we have everything set up the way we like it. Match stats is up there. They've had the first shot. We're going to go ahead and uh, encourage... The boys. I mean, realistically, we take a draw at Etihad, right? Realistically. Half an hour gone. It's still nil-nil. First highlight. Jack Grealish with a corner. Ben White heads out. Grealish back in for Erling Haaland. And who else, ladies and gentlemen? Who else to kick off Man City's Premier League campaign other than Erling Haaland from a corner? It went back out from Ben White. Grealish. Who, who was on Erling Haaland? Declan Rice. Got absolutely bodied and Manchester City lead 1-0. We've not had a shot yet. I think maybe more direct. Focus down the right and left. And get early crosses in. Not the debut. Demand. Well, I mean, it is Manchester City. This is the one team. I, you know, I mean, Liverpool are pretty good too. Man, you are normally good on FM. Oh, it's going to be a long year. Good save, Aaron Ramsdale. Fantastic save. We'll bring the speed down a little bit. Can we at least like see a shot? This match is Bukayo Saka. Oh, Saka, what have you done? Good into Saka. Oh, Gabriel, you stepped up. You missed. Oh, Bernardo Silva scores. That comes from Saka. And it's 2-0 Manchester City. The 3-4-3. Three, four, uh, four, three. Have we gone too defensive with the formation? I don't know. What I do know, we are getting absolutely dominated. Half time. Um, Right, I mean, there's nothing to lose. We're going to go 4-2-3-1. We're going to go... You as a advance forward. Odegaard in the cam position. Party sit back as that ha uh, as the anchor still. Zinchenko, wing back, uh, attack. You can go and attack as well. We're just going to go attacking. We're going to go attacking. I don't see the point in in sitting back anymore. Who's on a 6? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who's on a 6.2? Who's on a 6? Bukayo Saka. I mean, that makes sense. He gave away the second goal. Second half, let's go out there and have a different half, boys. 6.1 for Saka. He's supposed to be Starboy. All right, here we go again. First highlight. It's not even our highlight. First attack of the game. It's not even our attack. Phil Foden. Oh, force a good save off Ramsdale. How are the defensive tactic? There we go. Where's the counter-attack at? Martinelli. Martinelli running all the way. Who's that? Zinchenko's up there with it. Oh, he's offside against his former team. He stepped offside. Right, we might as well make changes. Saka's been god-awful. We'll bring on... Oh, what do we do? Jesus. Out on the right-hand side. Kai Havertz. Can be our striker. Oh, this is awful, boys. We'll try Smith Rowe on the right, actually. It's not gone to plan. But it's gone, I think, how a lot of people expected it to go. Saliba was tied before this match. We'll take him off. We'll bring on Kivio. We've had three shots. None on target. Zinchenko with a throw. Declan Rice. TP over to Ben White. Oh my god, what's up with the passing? What is with the passing that I'm seeing? Absolutely shambolic display of football right now. Zinchenko gives it straight back to his former team. Oh, he's still a Man City player. Phil Foden runs through 3-0. What a start to the series. What a start to the season. See, I feel like if I played them in the in the community shield, I would have known how to play them a bit better. That's that's missing that that. Community Shield was not ideal. 
Crossart can... I mean, it's... It's... It's done. It's... Martinelli, can we at least score one? No. Oh, Ben White is giving the ball away again. The passing, boys. Where is that... Uh, you know... Arsene Wenger football. Arteta football. Where's the... Tuvi's Tiki Taka? Here goes Trossard. New man for... Oh, my God. What is the finish, though? You run all the way for that? To not have a single shot on target at the Etihad is disgraceful. Absolutely disgraceful. It really is. I don't want to see the last highlight. I don't want to see it. Full-time whistle. Bold Pep Guardiola celebrates. 3-0. Away loss. Your team talk had a positive effect on the team. I just got an achievement. I didn't see no positive effects. There. Arsenal loan at David Rea. He has joined us, ladies and gentlemen. Playmaking goalkeeper. 16 passing. My goodness. Right, we have Chelsea next in the Premier League. The board will expect us to draw, ladies and gentlemen. I did say we're going to play both, but we're going to end this one there. We're recording for 40 minutes now, and I just want to get episode one out there for you guys. So, that concludes episode one of the Arsenal... Journey rebuild is not really a rebuild. We're just trying to win the Champions League with them. Um, so yeah, three 0 away loss against Manchester City. Not the way we wanted to start, but at least we got Etihad out of the way, ladies and gentlemen. Leave a thumbs up on this video if you have enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for an FM journey. Football managers here on the channel to stay alongside Okoro Chimwenwe, and I'm very, very excited. Much of as always, take care and peace. Uh, and also, before you leave, before you leave. Uh, click on one of these two videos. I think they're like up here. That left and right. They're somewhere on the screen right. <laughs> they are. Yeah, there you go. Click click on click on one of them. Oh. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you click on one of the videos, um, you can move on to the next one. Make sure you stay on this channel though. Reading Skin channel. You know, subscribe if you haven't already. 50,000 around the corner. One of these. Hey. You know.